Good morning, guys, gals, gays, and days. Period. I am making an omelet and I got some onions underneath this finish. But I would just like to say I'm very much standing on top of business because I just finished an entire thing of spinach. Okay, I didn't let it wilt. I didn't let it go bad. I ate the whole motherfucking thing. Okay, period. Hey, you all. What's popping? I just got off work. It is 6 30 on a Friday night. So I'm about to just finish the one that I had yesterday. Um, I don't know about y'all, but I love Soda Home. Okay, period. Soda Home. Call me. Okay. Um, but yeah, I'm just about to chill on the couch, watch some movies. I wish I were out in the streets tonight, but you know. I'm not. I have to work in the morning. But anyway, I came over here to ask you guys, how do y'all feel about separating the artist from the art? Um, I did a podcast on this. I don't have my microphone. I really need to get the podcast back up. But I'm kind of more comfortable in front of the camera so I can, I feel like I'm like interacting with you guys. Um, but I was watching Shannon Sharp's interview with the baby today. And I know that we canceled the baby due to his homophobic comment but honestly he is so intelligent and i just think every all plays fuck up you know what i'm saying so i think that was just a little fuck up moment but cancel culture will not let you live like yeah i just gonna cancel them all the way out like i don't know i'm not that kind of person i i give you a little chance you know what he said was none of his business you know what i'm saying it was none of his business there was no excuse for that but honestly like i love like when he first came out i was on the baby heavy like heavy like pony shit like i love his music so much and i kind of stopped listening to it but i'm gonna put that back on my playlist my gym playlist i i love him i'm not gonna lie. listen to him talk he's actually so intelligent he just had a moment like just think about it if you were in front of cameras all day every day you would have a moment too i'm sure you do things that you don't want people to see you know or, or you know hear people you have things that you said that you would want the public, everybody on planet Earth to know about. You know, being a celebrity, I couldn't even imagine. I know it's hard. So I think we can do that because I, I have very problematic faves. Like if you know me, you know, I am a breezy fan to the death of me. OK, I'm going to try to insert that little TikTok because uh, Rose the Reds, Violet the Blue. If you don't, Chris Brown, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. OK period i'm team breezy 1000 percent. but people that i don't get down with are going to be r kelly and bill cosby what they did was dead and wrong okay and yes i know breezy was wrong too okay i'm very well aware very well aware um but yeah you know you gotta pick your battles it's it's not that big of a deal it's really not so yeah, that's all I came here to say. Leave me a comment though. Let me know what you think about it. Like, how do you feel? You ain't gotta tell me how you feel about Chris Brown because I D G A F. Um, but what y'all think about like Bill Cosby and um, who else I said? R Kelly, Chow, and the baby. What y'all think about the baby? What y'all think? Y'all think he deserves no chance or wait? Cause I don't know. I'm gonna give him another little chance, Chow. I don't know. I, I feel like you know. Again, what he said was very wrong. He should have shut the fuck up. But yeah, I'm, I'm finna listen to Pony. Sorry. Happy Friday night. Hey y'all. Happy Sunday. As you can see, I just got done with a little walkie walk. Um, I haven't been able to go on a walk in so long because the weather, um, it gets so dark so early now. So, well, it gets dark early and then during the mornings i have been so tired because i've been working so much or it's been gloomy like today it was gloomy but i was like you know what i'm getting my butt out this bed and i'm fixing to go get my walk on period so i'm about to go to a few stores i'm gonna go to walmart i ordered my christmas tree from target it's just i got a six foot christmas tree for 27 dollars period so i'm about to go get that and then i'm gonna go to walmart to pick up like ornaments and stuff so let's go Okay, guys, we are in Walmart getting some Christmas things. This is actually green. I don't know why it looks gray on camera, but it's so pretty. I'm getting these two. Um, they're not buffalo um, 
they they kind of are, but it's giving you know I don't know it's giving me some kind of Christmas vibe, so I'll make it work too. Um, I just got a few little ornaments, and then I got some lights to put on my patio, and we're just going and vibing and see, seeing what finds us. Uh, you guys, I love this time of year. The cart is full. We are definitely over budget, but it's okay. You guys, one thing I love, no matter where I am, I can always see the little city skyline. I love that for me. Hey, y'all. I am just doing some laundry. Um, I got all this stuff. So, let me tell you what I've been doing. So... I went and did my Christmas shopping. I went to Cheddar's and got me a little spinach dip. Um, and then I came home, showered, and I laid down. I did not take a nap, but I did lay down. Um, so now I'm just about to do some laundry, and then we're gonna put up the Christmas tree. So I'm super excited. Um, I'm finally getting in the Christmas spirit. Again, I'm usually a person that doesn't put, if you hear the noise, it's my trash can child. Tila is just, I'm gonna turn her all chill. So yeah, I wasn't really in the Christmas spirit because again, I'm very much a person that waits until after Thanksgiving to put up decorations. Um, but honey, I went in there and I saw all the Christmas decorations, all the Christmas trees, they were so beautiful. And so we're gonna go ahead and put the tree up because I'm going home, I'm going back to the M. I can't do it with this hand. <laughs> I'm going back to Memphis for Thanksgiving. So I wanna come home to my Christmas tree up, you know? So I'm just about to do that and I'm gonna eat some leftovers from last night. I didn't even show you my pasta. It was so good and I have leftovers, so. I'm just gonna eat that. I'm gonna have some wine. And then it's Sunday night, so baby, Mary to Madison, Real Housewives of Potomac. Last night, we watched Love and Marriage Huntsville. And then I also watched The Bell Collective. The Bell Collective really ain't giving like it's supposed to gave. So I'm really like coming up off of her. And then up here I have my um, my wreath that I'm gonna put out, but I'm not gonna put like my outside decorations up until I come back. My mommy, if you don't know, she's a very crafty lady. Um, and this is my little wreath. This is a reindeer, it's real, real cute. So I'll show y'all that whenever it goes up. But yeah, I was just coming to check in with y'all, let y'all know what's going on. When I get to putting the tree up, of course I'll take y'all with me. Okay, you guys, so I'm about to put up the tree. If you want to see like me uh, read like decorating the whole house, you can have to go to TikTok or Instagram, chels.so.lovely, um, cause I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm still new, okay, in the content creation world, baby. I can't, I can't keep up with all three, okay? I'm trying my hardest, okay, I'm trying. Um, so obviously I'm gonna get footage for you guys because YouTube is like my fave, I'm not gonna lie. Um, but yeah, if you want to select it more in depth like of the whole like my whole apartment, go check out my TikTok or my Instagram. Um, but I'm just gonna put the tree up. Again, it's Sunday night. I got Real Housewives of Potomac on. So I got to go and I got to go get this tea. Period.
on you guys i am getting ready to go to the eye doctor i am so hot i'm sweating and i hate sweating when i'm getting ready so i'm just about to go get a little um eye exam i'm trying to show you guys my outfit but i'm already late well not actually late but like i like to be early and it's 9 30 and my appointment's at 10 and it's 13 minutes away ideally i should i should be leaving i should be in my car right now but anyways i'm wearing my favorite perfume ever it is my burberry black it smells so good i just realized i sprayed three pumps you only need two i'm telling you i've had that perfume for a year and it's also one of the ones that you don't like sorry rambling um trying to get my little spoolie but i'm telling you i've had that i think i got that last christmas and you see it's still like halfway full so okay i'll show you my outfit in a minute i got to go happy monday okay so real quick period you see the christmas tree i have on this black it's actually like a gym set top but it's like a crop top so i have on this i have on these yoga pants which i got from wally world and then i also have on my adidas um i ordered some new balance but they're not here yet and they would have been perfect with this outfit but anyway got on my watch ring from my man and then i just kept it real simple with a little jewelry child so yeah peace out and i got my little jacket so got to go holler you guys i am so annoyed i just um so you know i was going to the eye, uh, my eye appointment right i was going to america's best and i called like when i made the appointment to see like to make sure they took my um entrance right and i was told that they did so i drive all the way there okay my bad but what i was saying yeah so i called to make sure that they accepted my insurance because this is my first time like being an adult and like having an appointment you know like going to the eye doctor like on my own like i know that's probably crazy but it is so i'm just calling to like make sure because i don't know how the insurance works i always get my glasses from like i buy direct or like zilu so you know i'm like okay let me go get an updated you know i exam i need some new frames let me use my insurance so get there they're like my you drove 15 minutes there they're like oh we don't accept this insurance anymore they're like do you still want to do the exam it's it's a hundred dollars and we have you know buy uh, to you know get get to a pair of glasses for 80 bucks cool great great deal you guys but why would i pay that when i can go somewhere like the whole point of this is for me to use my insurance like i have like an, an account that i like can pay with for the service with why would i spend the hard earned cold cash out of my pocket why would i do that i drove 15 minutes there 15 minutes back a total of 30 minutes it's not even the time i just hate wasting my time like i there's nothing more annoying than wasted time to me and i like that's like one of my like core values like do not waste my time i'm so annoyed but I'm trying not to be so I'm about to go to Walmart I'm going back to Walmart um I'm about to DIY the hell out of a little project um and I'm also going to treat myself to Popeyes so there's that but I'm so annoyed and I'm really such an optimistic person like if you know me you know like I'm really always like peppy and positive but I be having my moments okay and this was one of them that just annoyed me so bad and then when I walked in like they had like blowers going and there was like no one in the front so and like their doors are wide open and then the place next to it is boarded up and so i'm like first off i should have just turned around like that was my first thought like go home but i'm like you know what let me not be like that let me just go in and let me see what's popping should have took my ass home should have turned around Oh, I'm so annoyed, but it's okay because I'm finna get me a little strawberry biscuit from Popeyes and it's gonna turn my mood around. Uh, I'm just, I'm trying so hard to let go. Like I put on this cute little outfit. I'm finna wear this outfit back to the airport. So when you see me in it, you gonna see me in it. I D G A F. Let me go to Walmart child and get up at this funky mood. You guys, how effing cute does it look in here? Uh, I flocked my tree. I don't feel like you can really tell kind of sort of not really like i feel like it's more white in some parts than others and that kind of makes me mad but i'm gonna figure it out i'm gonna make it work but y'all i painted these pictures all by myself it probably cost me a total of seven dollars 
max um ugh, i just love how it looks and y'all know these pictures can be so expensive um but i did record unfortunately i didn't record on here it was so much going on at one point i was on the phone with my man another point i was on the phone with my bestie um and then i was trying to get content for like tiktok and instagram and i forgot to f film for youtube which happens quite often but you know love you guys so yes uh this is what it's giving um here's me period so yeah i flocked the tree uh, i'm about to put up the ornaments and the you know just decorate the tree and then y'all the gag is i got lights to go outside on my patio not even a socket out there so bummer and yeah i'm gonna get like obviously more knickknacks like some cute little reindeer my theme is just gold and green like i want to keep it on scheme like i want to keep it on scheme with like my actual vibe like i don't really care for the whole traditional red and green christmas um red just doesn't fit my vibe so we're just gonna stick with the green i'm gonna get some green um pillow covers and just some more christmas pillows in here and then obviously i'm gonna change out my bedding too so it's beginning to look a lot like christmas period um but yeah i'm just about to make me some dinner and i'm chilling i'm chilling for the rest of the night Today's been a really good off day besides the whole eye doctor thing, which I think I told y'all about. So, yeah, happy Monday. I hope you guys are having a very great and chill evening like me. Bone apple teeth. I haven't been co cooking much, like, at all. Um, this is a turkey patty with some grilled onions, some pot roasted potatoes, and some broccoli. Period. Trying to eat right before the effing holidays. Hello, good morning you guys. It is cold and windy here in Dallas, Texas. It is an easy breezy 59 degrees. Um, I came on here to tell y'all about um, layering perfumes. So, okay, I have this perfume that I don't like very much from Bath & Body Works. I don't hate it, but it's like one little note in there that just throws it off. Like it's super sweet um, and I want that. Like I want sweetness. So I'm gonna pair this with my La Vie and I'm not sure I'm not a French speaker I speak Spanish okay but this one I'm gonna pair it on top because this is like a this is like a good strong grown woman smell like I don't know how to describe it let me see I don't know it's just a good it's just a good grown woman smell I don't know I'm gonna have to link them but pairing these two together it's kind of like a muskier I don't know. It doesn't smell like a man. Like, it's not that kind of musky. You just don't have to go smell it, child, okay? But pairing those two together is, like, a perfect combination. Like, it gives it a, like, you smell the grown woman, but then immediately after, it's, like, sweet. Yeah. Double it up. You guys, our next-door neighbors just invited us to their holiday party at work. Oh, my gosh. And they brought us these cookies. Good morning, lovelies. Period. <laughs> Period. Anyways, y'all, I packed last night um, because, you know, I'm going to Memphis for Thanksgiving. Period. I'm so excited. But tell me why the fuck did my suitcase rip? Uh, Jesus, I can't have nothing. So now I got to go get a new damn luggage on top of me having to take, what is it called? The train. I'm already anxious, okay? I've been anxious anxious since last night about taking this damn train because if you don't know, I am incredibly directionally challenged and terrified of getting lost. And so originally my bestie was gonna take me but he had to get his hair cut. And so I'm like, now it's back to the train. Cause the train is literally right down the street. So, but I talked to um, this girl that I know and she said it was super easy, she helped me out. So. I'm gonna take the train child, but now I gotta go get luggage and everything before my flight. And I'm supposed to leave at like three. But we'll see, we'll see. I might leave, I don't know. I'm stressed out, okay? I just, wanna, I just wanna be home already. I wish I could just teleport and skip all of this. Cause apparently there's like 3 million flights going in and out of Texas today. So, yay, holiday travel, woohoo. Anyway, it's Wednesday. I am excited. I can't wait to get home tonight. I'm going straight to my favorite Mexican spot. Um, and yeah, my arm is hurting because yesterday was arm day. But anyway, happy hump day, you guys.
soap we got the toothbrush with the cap cover toothpaste of course two towels please ain't nobody and then y'all this is my childhood bedroom like my scheme like my whole bed scheme as a child was pink and orange period and then if it's loud in here it's because i got the fan on 10 but my grandma is just so cute i'm just so happy to be home i'm so happy Happy holidays, happy Thanksgiving. Uh, you guys, I'm so happy to be home. Me and Michael, look at my daddy. Tinky, say hey, Papa's. Hey, Tinky. We're just going on a little walk. Here I am, right here. Wait a minute, hold on. We're just going on a little walk, me and my baby. I just got on the same slippers I can wear on the plane. Which way you wanna go? Let's go this way. Let's go this way, Papa's. Yeah, so we're just gonna walk. I'm just gonna listen to some music. My grandma was putting them greens in that pot, child. It's, um, I forgot my watch, but it's like eight o'clock in the morning, like 8.30. Um, me and my aunt said, or, really, or me and my grandma and my aunt said, I played last night, so. We were just chatting and catching up, girl. So yeah, me and my tanky gonna go on a walk. Look at his cute jacket. That's just me, baby. Okay, y'all, I'll see y'all later. Okay. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Yay. Mommy. Say happy Thanksgiving. Say happy Thanksgiving to YouTube. Happy Thanksgiving to YouTube. Tobinia. Say happy Thanksgiving to YouTube. Happy Thanksgiving. Y'all get in. I say you. Welcome. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. From our family to yours on the Disney Channel. Do, 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 do. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh. My teacher gonna come get me. <gasps> Let me see some moves. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Hello. This is good, mom. Back it up, honey. Wow. Do you work out? What's the routine? Anything to get these muscles. I don't know. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Let me let me give me five push ups right now. Give me five good ones now. Okay, they're pretty good. Oh, did you say it all? I can do that. Good job being a self date. Ah, y'all be going crazy. She said this one got the time. Hi. Hi. We're, we're just going to get something to eat real quick. Get something to eat. What are you going to get? You know? No. There's a straggler back there. Taco. Say hey, TT. What's up, y'all? You want to get a taco? What kind? Oh. 
Okay. We're gonna go get tacos. And we're back at it again. And we sure are. Period. You guys, why didn't y'all tell me tennis shoe life is the best life? I have worn these every day since I've been home. And they're so light, so airy. Um, I got these for $77. Period. We love a good deal. But I'm so obsessed with these. But I'm just at um we're at Hobby Lobby, not Home Depot. Um, my aunt went to grab my nephew a little Rubik's Cube, and I'm just being a passenger princess as I should. Period. But yeah, I'm just obsessed with my little shoes. And then I got my necklace with my husband's name on it. Let me see. Let me get myself together, child. Got my little necklace with my husband's name on it. I just got on like this little sheen crop top. And I got these yoga pants. They're, they're the same ones I wore um, the other day when I was supposed to go to the eye doctor. Um, I just got on those with my little new balance. So, yeah. So, I'm about to go to my mom's house for a little bit. And then I'm going to go to the airport. And I'm going back home. Period. Happy Saturday.